Hey everybody, it's uh, it's Vision over here, and uh, just wanted to you know talk about some stuff. It's a little different style of video today. I'm um, you know experimenting with a bunch of different other stuff like the gameplays and all that, and all of it is just like fun to make, and it's just have I'm having a blast. Not just recording, but actually getting everything because the hardest thing right now, at least for me, is uh, is recording. I just go through the Xbox and, you know, clip things and just I'll go over them and try and edit them the best I can. So I think that's really enjoyable, but I'm just going to have, like, gameplay circle in the background throughout the this whole thing, right? So right now it's going to be, like, some Modern Warfare 3 beta clips and everything, which was an amazing beta, by the way, like, at least in my opinion. Obviously, everybody's entitled to their own right opinion and all that, but I enjoyed the beta. It was uh, it was pretty smooth. Everybody was like, oh, slide canceling, slide canceling. I mean, yeah, it was just, that wasn't my biggest concern. My biggest concern was that, is it going to feel good and is it going to be fun? And it definitely felt good and it definitely felt fun, right? I was doing games on Rust where like, I was obviously playing a little slower than... I should be playing, but hey, I'm getting kills, you know, fragging out a little bit, just doing whatever, for real, and it's just, there's a bunch going on, like, sniping was great, if, uh, there's one thing I want to give at least a little bit of feedback for this beta, right, is that the sniping, amazing, however, the thing with the sniping is that I don't feel like there was enough flinch for the sniper's person. And I, I don't like to say that, right? Because I'm a very big advocate of, hey, snipers are amazing. I like I like running around with snipers. Sniping is fun, right? It takes a lot more skill because obviously you only have your one shot. But there was actively points in that beta where I was running around and I was like ADSing at somebody's like upper chest and they would shoot me first and the flinch would bounce up like maybe their neck. And that's, I feel like that's gonna get a lot of people a little bit angry, complain about it. Cause I feel like a lot of people are gonna be dying to snipers a lot more in Warzone. And like, I, I always enjoy the one shot headshot everything because I feel like it requires skill and it's a really it's a it's a good balancing point. The, the players that are using a weapon that can fire slowly should be rewarded for aiming for the head. But I feel like that's just the case. And that's just always made sense to me. If you aim for head, like no matter what, you're just always gonna get the kill faster, right? And that's not just in Modern Warfare 3 that that requires like skill in a bunch of other games as well like Apex and Siege like in Siege you obviously want to always be aiming for head because one shot headshot Apex TTK is a lot slower than COD so obviously you want to get as many headshot mix-ups in there as possible because if you can do that then shoot you know how fast you kill somebody with headshots it's amazing like I, I was actively trying to aim for head in the MW3 beta. It was a phenomenal time. Shoot, I felt like the times in where I felt like I wasn't beaming anybody, and I was just primarily shooting them in the head. Whenever I was actively going for those headshots, they were. I just felt like I was cooking them up in a blender. I was mixing them up like nonstop. It was amazing. But, I mean. Other than that, like I said, the beta, the beta was phenomenal. Had a very enjoyable time. I feel like now I'm just gonna go ahead, and just go ahead and just uh, start spitting off the top of my head, since this is a new form of content, right? I just wanted to try some stuff. Might be doing um, some vlogs here and there. I don't know. I haven't really decided what all I'm gonna do yet. Uh, I just want to do a bunch of different content, right? Obviously, I want to do a bunch of gaming. Right, because I've always enjoyed games since uh, growing up and everything. Because it's one of those things where it's like my dad showed me Halo 2. And ever since then, you know, always been excited to play. But other than that, I have different things that I'm interested in. 
Uh, I started getting recently back into watching baseball. I don't watch a lot of football. I didn't, like, football wasn't very interesting for me whenever I was growing up. But I can understand the appeal to other people that did watch it and everything. Well, now that I'm, like, older, I'm in a group chat with some of my some of my homies and everything. And I'll just go ahead and bet on whatever team I think is going to win. But I've been watching uh, the Rangers games for the past couple of days now that they've been going on. Yesterday's game was uh, phenomenal. And uh, I'm glad that we won, you know. We got, like, two more games to win against the Astros. But I believe by the time this video is going up, we have they'll be playing tonight again. So probably be watching that. Might make you know some more close things in there, hints at a little bit more and all that. So, but other than that, shoot, I mean the game that I watched, it was there was amazing part. <laughs> I was watching it while I was at work, right? And they managed to technically fumble the ball. And, uh, like, the, I, was, I think it was the Astros that were able to make a little bit of a comeback. So it was a little scary because I am a, I'm a Rangers fan. But, you know, other than that, if you were here, you know, thank you for watching the video and everything. It really means a lot. And I do believe that it's going to be it for whatever, I guess, montage this is. Everybody have a good rest of your day. Vision out.